Oh my dear God, man. What a lovely day. Ladies, gentlemen, boys and girls. What's up and what's happening, Captain? As you guys can see, it's your host with the most Paul can too. Back with a brand new trip to the thrifts. We're live outside of the Salvation Army right now. And uh, yeah, I just wanna shout out all you guys, number one, who shop on thriftadvantage.com. It's support, of course, me and my operation. I love you guys. And I love y'all who drop these comments that always keep my eyes and mind guessing as to what you guys are gonna say. Ah! Oh my God! Let's hop into the thrift style. All right, y'all, walking in the building. First and foremost, the furniture section is absolutely beautiful in here. They have the couch that I actually have in a different color scheme alive in here. They have some amazing colors. I love that green couch. This chair is absolutely fantabulous. Nice. All these leather couches. Dude, I'm about to start my own adult film. You feel me? Series. We just got hella different couches too, not the same old one that you're used to seeing. Anyways, guys, um, I guess I'm gonna drop my finds on this table. I have perused in here and there's not much at all, but I figured I might as well share the three little finds I did get. First of all, you have the Patagonia. Look at these, man. Argentinian, bright yellow like the sun of their flag. Shorts, and then to match it, we have a full thrift fit. You have the Super Bowl. What is that? Um, I have no idea how to read Roman numerals, but <laughs> stupid. But you got the Super Bowl tee with the Rams logo. Super old school looking. I thought this was a vintage shirt, then I examined it, and it was double stitched on the sleeve, which doesn't always mean it's not vintage. But then I got out my damn magnifying glass, and it says 2017. But this graphic is so clean, so yeah, it is a little reprint. And then one time for the ladies, man, if you guys need any jerseys, we got them on thriftheavenvintage.com, Orlando Magic, all embroidered. Youth size large, so this fits like a small, extra small, and adult human sizes, T-Mac jersey. What's up with it? Well, yeah, that's about it, man. On to the next one. Wait a second, I lied, there is one more thing. The full vintage tracksuit. Sit and be fit. Oh man, let's conduct our own workout program real quick. This is amazing. Oh yes, and here we are. So we've arrived at the next spot, the family thrift. And dude, look at these trees. They got the Mexican fam palms going absolutely crazy it looks beautiful here except they aren't really taking care of the shrubs but regardless that doesn't even matter uh without further ado let's get in the store and see if they have any vintage fire bro they got my guy just whipping i hate a what i hate a goofy especially bro i hate a goofy especially look at this fool and the piggy bank still got the bottom so i can put hella coinage and medallions up in my boy big goof whoopsies bro full steady whipping guys i'm not even gonna lie man i'm in here i've looked through like this whole store and good news is they brought out the jackets but the bad news is i only found three things in a store that is enormous that's wild bro that's wild i mean i'm really gonna have to dig through the accessories and like toys and hopefully find some more i really wanted this piece got the hannibal pirates one hannibal sounds badass two pirates are cool Three, look at this all embroidered logo. But four, dude got straight stabbed in the sternum by Captain Hook. Is that your sternum? Bro, I don't know, I'm not a biologist. <laughs> then I found this really cool Illinois Illini. Nice little $6 price tag on this. Well, technically $5.45, but I round up quick math. Quick math. And then last and not least, man, you got my dude who throws hands on the field, the Andre Johnson, Houston Texans jersey absolutely legendary i'm gonna get this and then damn daniel, daniel. oh they got the vans in the peach colorway i'm not gonna get those but i'll grab these two things i want you so bad baby but i can't look past your flaws <laughs> oh my size bro they got the kanye west gap collab you just joking me perfect hold on Y'all can't tell me this shit don't fit, bro. Like a glove. Bro, I'm not even gonna hold you guys, man. I'm in the hat section and they got some contemporary bangers. These are like early 2000s Reebok 
um, one size fits all little stretch hats. But this Tampa Bay Buccaneers just goes nuts. And then you also have the um, Denver Broncos. This is looking like one of those popsicles, like a push pop. Bro, it is crispy. They got the Jets. This is really hard too with the designs on the sides. And then you have the Baltimore Ravens. I might have to get these, bro. Like, I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit, but these just go so hard. And they're all like brand new, never before worn, dead stock hats. And I know they would fit like a gym. But God, the two-tone on the Tampa Bay got me wet. All right, guys, we jumped out of the family thrift. Got a light little sack. But the homie official running back, it's vintage, right? Or just official running back? Official underscore running back vintage, yeah. Yeah, he found this amazing vintage Tweety Bird comforter. This shit goes nuts. How much did you get it for, bro? Bro, I got this. So I'm telling you, they just told me three bucks. And I was like, all right, fuck it, three bucks. Bro, for three dollars, bro. Wow. That is wild. But it looks like he has even more sheets up in here. So you guys can be getting frisky in style. Or if you just have kids, you know, we'll keep it appropriate. You have the Toy Story sheet as well with big boy Woody telling off Buzz Lightyear. Bruh, that is fire. They're like customizers who make jackets out of like comforters like that and that'd be insane. Both of those as like jackets or just on the bed in general. What is this, a transformer? Yeah, Bro, a you, Power Ranger right here. That's a Power Ranger? Oh, it's Mighty Morphin time, bruh. Hell yeah. God damn, daddy. This fool is gonna pull up on the cardboard city just destroy it. Bro, he's lit. Shit, I appreciate you showing me these things though, dog. Yeah, That's crazy. Y'all go fucks with my man. And all right, guys, we've arrived at the next one, dude. It is August in Texas. There is no wind. It is hot as balls out here, dude. It is hotter than the devil's ding dong, bro. <sighs> But hopefully it gets even hotter inside the building. Let's get some fire. All right, we can roast the marshmallow with this slight little heat we got going on right here. But oh, we got three finds already, man. I've been waiting for this jersey to go on sale. You have the Jason Witten Dallas Cowboys jersey. I can't get over him playing with the Raiders right now. Trippy. But he was a straight beast for the Cowboys. Over the middle, caught by Witten, who loses his helmet, but still keeps going. And then you have the Lotto Panama jersey. Authentic, it's less than $2, $1.41. Might as well, just look at that hologram. My God, dude. Uh, and then you have the Carson Palmer jersey, USC quarterback turned Bengals QB. Carson Palmer is super underrated. Um, is Joe Burrow gonna be rocking the number nine as well? I'm not exactly sure, but it's like seven. Seven! So, I'll take it. Jeez, bro, they got some jackets that go stupid up in here. Hold up, let me get that sleeve out. They have that Missouri Tigers, all embroidered, heavy, logo seven. Seven! Missouri on the back with the M in the Paul print. That's nice, but then this one is even better, bro. $13 Nebraska leather corn huskers jacket. My guy. Look at the back of this bad boy. Oh my god. Bro, send me to the fields right now. I'll rock that. No cap. Alrighty guys, so I've been perusing for a minute and I just want to shout out the homie Todd who blessed me with this amazing new school all over print jersey right here. This thing is absolutely glorious. This ain't the original 24 though. It's Mr. Elliot. What's his first name? Like Kyle? Cole? What is it? Oh, it's Chase. Um, and then some other pieces I got. You guys know Puma Life, my sponsor. You have the Italian, look at the detail, all embroidered. Daniel De Rossi jersey. Parte De Rossi. Oh my god, bro. This long sleeve is so crispy and it's only two dollars. Let's get it. And you got some Tommy for your mommy right here. Three bucks essential. I love it. Look at all the little details on the collar. That's nice. I have this multi colored kind of 6 9 clown rendition flannel and then another Tommy for who? Your mommy, double XL, all embroidered little crew neck. So I figured I'd grab that. We all need essentials in the closet every twice in a while, but yeah, the cart is overflowing in here. 
<sighs> Thank God. All right, guys. We're up out this thing, man. And yes. So yeah, guys, I'm out here putting my arm to get you slinging all this vintage in these tree little sacks. Dude, that store came through finally, bro. I had like three shots before this that weren't really hitting at all, but the fourth one smacked. And I love it. Oh my God, guys. We got it, the grail. God bless America and no place else, God damn it. Check out this jacket, Dad Nabbit. You got the starter that goes harder. Shout out Randy Monahan, US Olympic windbreaker. My dear God. You got the Olympic rings on one sleeve. You got the flags on both. Flipping and dipping, the starter tramp stamp on the back of that neck. My dear God, baby. I'm a mother freaking star. Yes, sir. Yeah, checks over stripes. That's what I like. Yes, that's what we like. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, dude, you got the Made in USA. Vintage Nike. Come on, Tag, work with me. Crew neck. Ah, noteworthy. Hold on. Hold on. I like this. Oh, yeah, that's my style, right? I like those colors right there. Can match anything with this. Except neon. Bro, back to back. My guy Tigger is tooting that ass up, staring at his reflection. Uh, yeah, that's cool. And then you got another one where he's just standing with his name encrusted on himself like a student was punished and had to hit that chalkboard with hella words repeating themselves. Bruh, that fool hit that hell with the punishment. Bro, I'm not even gonna hold you guys. This might be one of the hardest crew necks of all time personal collection i think it has to be not only does it have apples on the sleeves it has these giant sunflowers birds it has text on their houses this thing is absolutely amazing and it's dead stock oh my it is hey you also got the members only fuck with me and the new york knicks at night bro my guy holding this skull up like damn rafiki over here I What's up, Santa Fe, New Mexico? Single stitch in this bitch. Oh, God damn it! look at this little patriotic piece. There ain't nothing more American than some early onset heart disease, baby. Clogged them arteries in style. Cold beer and cheeseburgers, baby. University of good times. Oh, man, I already paid my tuition, baby. Automatic acceptance. <laughs> Jeez, dude. Kansas, man. You know, I got nothing more going on than what's on this shirt. This is a crazy piece. Just kidding. I love all my Kansadians. This is a fire piece. Wow. Now, there's a message I can get behind, goddammit. Just shut up and bowl. Just shut the hell up and bowl, all right, guys? Just shut up. Just shut the hell up. Just shut up. Oh, my tits. Dude, this store today. Look at this. You got the brandy and spice. Mix it up. Huh? Spiced brandy by Corbell. Old school tea, super he rose. More like super he hoes. You feel me? Hey, low key. I'd animate myself, draw my life in pipe. <laughs> you can't blame me. Bro, <laughs> I don't know what it is, but I promise you guys this. We're finding grails back to back. Check it out, man. The man, the myth, the legend, 316, Stone Cold Steve Austin, making that face only a mother could love. Bruh. Let's go. Hey, also, look at this. You have that vintage Nike gray tag made in USA as well. So I thought the white tag was old, but we just got a little bit older. Huh? must cop bro y'all know what time it is man last find in this store you got the mickey mouse straight spiking the ball is that what they call it in tennis i don't know but i hate a what my brothers i hate a goofy especially my boy caught a concussion via tennis ball bro let's go all right y'all we're up out of family thrift y'all can't lie that goofy mickey like collab tennis piece was banging we're at the next spot right now um and my parking spot is so close it goes dummy, bro. Like, there's my car and there's the entrance. What? The only thing in the way is a handicap spot. 
I hope I trip over this cone and break a leg, then that's gonna be mine. Oh my. Bro, I love it whenever I just gain momentum in the thrift. I just found this on a rack that was rolled out. It is this amazing 90s Thunderbolt Air Force T. Oh my dick, bro. What is that? Is that babe? My brothers. This thing goes so hard. Multicolored, double-sided. I'm excited. To who dollars? Bro, we got another crazy find right off rip. You have the vintage Omnitech Columbia $10 jacket, yellow, red, and blue. This is what that Forever 21 gear was aspiring to be. My God, dude. It gets no more 90s and crazy than this. Made in Portland, USA, God damn it! I'm also like 99% sure this jacket goes with this one. So together they'd be like 17 bucks. Um, they're kind of some for trying to sell them separately, but I cannot let this couple get divorced up in the thrift store, bro. If it's up to me, they staying together forever. I'm just that guy, bro. I'm like a thrift counselor, dog, straight up. Bro, another one, man. I'm finding some dope jackets in here. Polo Ralph Lauren. Look at the little polo golden zipper. Quilted military green jacket. High quality, and yes, it's Ralph level. I'm in line right now, and just hanging up was this New York Mets all embroidered majestic, or should I say majestic, still very clean, Carlos Santana jersey. I know that's not actually who that is, but bro, this jersey goes dummy, bro. Straight up. And just like that, man, we're out of there. Bro, we got hella bags of stuff in that store. I'm happy, man. I think that might be the last stop of the day, and it definitely came through for your boy. Fuck with me. Killing these songs, leaving them bloody like Pyrus. And I'm in it to win it, so I'm somebody that you should get used to.